，一，一，一，呀，喂。Don't do this to me now. There we go. There we go. All right. Some NHL 14 shenanigans, huh? Hey, I got bored of NHL 23. That shit is so repetitive. I bought this shit for like nine bucks. Absolute W cop. Absolute dub. All right. So I am currently doing a Flyers franchise here, and we are still in year one. We just got past the trade deadline. Let me show you guys this team. It is quite. It's decent. Uh, we really started off really slow. We were really bad at the beginning. Uh, you got first line Voracek, Braden Jen, Claude Giroux. Now remember, this is prime Claude Giroux. He's 26 at this point. And dog. I mean, look at his season. He's not. I mean, it's almost a point per game. He's getting there. He was doing a little worse. He got injured at some point this season as well. Voracek, he's doing pretty good as well. 45 points in 69 games. Nice. Uh, and then we also traded for Ant. Oh shit. Andrew Cogliano, if you know about Andrew Cogliano in NA the older NHL games like NHL 14, look at the skating. 93 speed, 93 excel, but he's fast as fuck. He is so fast. Really, really, really good. He was an absolute stud in these games. You got Hartsey and Simmons. You got Eric Wellwood, Maxime Talbot, Matt Reed. And then the fourth line is a bunch of goons. Literally, it's a goon line. I had no other. I had no other choice. And we also made a trade where we traded Chris Pronger, uh, even though we're we were in a playoff spot. I still traded him because you get a first out of a 39 year old defenseman that wasn't even playing that good. Yeah, we traded him to Boston, and I'll show you guys all the draft picks. We have three first round picks. We have one from Boston. We did a trade with New York when they wanted Mark Streit, which. Why would anyone want an 82 overall, 5 mil, 4-year deal, Mark Streit? That is just, hey. I have the trade difficulty on hard, so you can't say I'm finessing. No, 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 no. I am, I should be the one getting finessed. It took me, I, I went for Martin St. Louis. And the amount of stuff I would have had to give up would have been absolutely terrible. I, there was no way in hell I was doing it. So, free agents, uh, coming up, free agents. You got Patrice Bergeron, the Sedins, Phil the Thrill. I'm hoping he might be there. That might be someone I go for because I have created a little bit of cap space here. Also, goaltenders. This is where we need to look here. Martin, he's 41 years of age. If Lundqvist were <laughs> to hit the market, that'd be something. Tuka Rask, that'd be interesting. Uh, Corey Crawford, Yaroslav Halak, a young Yaroslav Halak, 28 years of age. Ilya Brisk, no, 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 no. I'm getting flashbacks seeing that name. No. I mean, actually, Steve Mason's putting up a Vesna-worthy season, actually. He really is. Uh, let me show you guys stats, 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 stats. Stats Central, player. He's doing really, really good this year. Uh, if it would load. Yeah, these this game goes really slow with loading. It, hey, this is what playing on 360 was. It's back in the day. And we also signed Tim Thomas. He's doing pretty well, even though he's lost more games than he's won. He's still not doing bad. Steve Mason's putting up a Vesna-type season. He's got a 9... Wait. Let me do it this way. It shows better stats this way. He has 31 wins, 20 losses in 57 games. Well, 23 losses. And he has a 917 save percentage and a 250 goals against. He's actually been really, really good for us. So that's been actually a good sign to see. New AI. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, a <laughs> sex spot just pop up. Ain't that something? All right, let's play a game. Why don't we? We got the Montreal. Oh, I need show standings. Show standings. Show standings. This is what you got to do. Show the standings. This is important because the, the East is so strong, and we've been on a losing skid here as of late. Uh, Eastern Conference. You got. We are ninth, and if I'm correct. It goes by the real life way now currently, which is top three and then wild card. And we're out of the wild card by one spot. And this big game here against Montreal, that can really determine it. And we are quite a little bit away from Pittsburgh, but we can be three back if we beat them here, uh, Montreal here. So this is a very, very big game we got going if we want to make playoffs. It's a really interesting spot we're in. We're kind of mid, but we're not terrible either. Uh, this is how they were at this time frame, the Flyers in real life, so... It's just, I have to deal with what I would, and oh yeah, Coots is out for like basically the rest of the season. So I'm basically going to have to deal with what I have to work with here. I want, we were really bad and I was actually looking forward to being really bad because if we were to suck, we get McDavid next, or have a chance for McDavid next year, that would have been great, but we, we don't have that no more. So, well, I mean, we still might, that's still a season away. So we could hope we might, I mean, one would say, I hope. 
but we'll find out. Well, we got the Habs here. Very big game for a uh, wild card seeding. I think that's how it was at this point. Was when they first switched over to how it is now, the the playoff format now, if I'm correct, where it's top three in division and then the two wild cards. If I'm correct, this is the first year because divisions are this way. I'm pretty sure this was the first year of it. Carey Price, prime Carey Price. This is gonna be very interesting. I want to see if he's a brick wall. Oh, the intro. The presentation in this game is so much better. So, so much better in this game than it is in NHL 23. Like, it blows it out the water. It's not even close. Not even. Look at the jersey. Best Flyers jersey of all time, potentially, right there. That Winter Classic jersey. Potentially the best. I'd say so. Look, look at it. It's so clean. Look at Claude Giroux right there, our captain. Number 28, Claude Giroux. Gary Thorne and Bill Clement commentating too. Absolute dub. There they are. It took them a little while to start talking there. Harry Price, he's having himself quite the season, but Steve Mason, too, he's been really, really good. Well, simming wise, but in some of the games I've played, we've had trouble trying to like save the puck. We've had a little bit of trouble with that, but we've gotten a lot better as the season's progressed. Now we got Andrew Cogliano, so it should be very, very interesting. I started this yesterday. All right, give it up to Voracek. Give me a little, give me a little Deke, Voracek. Ooh, ooh. I am playing on superstar difficulty, so it should be hard. Oh, I'm fucking completely missed the net. Way to go. The gameplay just feels so much smoother in this game. Like, it really does. It's definitely better than 23. Ooh, ooh, get it in there. Just keep the... Oh, carry price. Remember, this is prime carry price. He basically saves almost everything at this point in real life. Alright, Cogliano playing center. Interesting. Well, no. He, he doesn't play like a center. Well, they eventually... He, I don't know why he's even listed. Oh, Wayner. Oh, oh, I don't know why Wayne Simmons just started backskating. That made no sense. He had a potentially one T right opportunity right there. Mike Calmary. Holy shit. That is a name I have not seen in a long time. Oh, my. <laughs> Mike Calmary. Oh, shit. That is... There was a lot of names I've been seeing. Like, Ryan Whitney's in this game. He's a free agent. I should have signed him. But I, I, I did not. I did not sign on. I'm, I still can. But I'm not. As much as I, I love him. Alright. Got Eric Gustafson in the game. That, that's a little bit of a hazard. This is when he's on the Flyers. Before he actually became kind of good. Alright. Get the Wellwood. Maxime Talbot. Give it to Matt Reed. Flyers legend right here. Alright. Come on now. Matt Reeder. Reed. Reed. Oh. Oh. Throw it on. Oh, fuck. He got laid out. Yeah, a lot of the hits in this game. It just rem reminded me how big the hits are. They are quite big. <laughs> you will lay the fuck out of somebody. Like, watch. Maybe not with Eric Gustafson, but give me a little bit. I'll show you guys how big the hits are. All right. There we go, Gustafson. All right. Give it up to Giroux. Here we go. Oh, god damn. Come on. Get the puck. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Give it up to Voracek. Yeah, here we go. All right, forward check around the boards. Got Braden Shen. Oh, you fucking missed him. Okay, a little bit too much sauce on it. A little bit. Just a wee bit. Fucking lay his ass. Oh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. And the fighting in this, well, it's the same thing as the current games, the fighting. I mean, ain't broke, don't fix it. The fighting's perfectly fine. That's one thing. Oh, 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 goal, goal. Jacob forward check. Boom, boom, boom. Goal number one right there. There we go. Voracek's an absolute stud when playing this game. He's an absolute beauty. This first line is just absolutely dynamic. I, even when Coots wasn't hurt, a young Sean Couture, what is he, 21, 20 in this, at this point? Voracek's at 24, 25. Drew's 26. We basically have our first line in the future. It's just everything else. Is Steve Mason really that guy? No, in real life he wasn't, but yet again, this NHL 14, his potential is still quite decent, but I don't think he's going to be a franchise guy. We're going to have to look eventually somewhere. And then we have three first-round picks next year, and you know how good that 2015 draft class is. So, 
Alright, come on, Wayner. Wayne's young. You got Hartnell. He's still 31 years of age. Oh my god, Wayne just ate shit. Let's throw it on. Shot save. Days are nay. Fucking hit. Oh, <laughs> get fucked, buddy. Alright, come on. Come on, come on. Oh, we got a little bit of speed. Okay. Oh. Give it over. Give it over, Wayner. Oh, deflected out in front. Got Talbot. Ta oh. I forgot Max Talbot was on this team when I booed this up yesterday. I didn't, re I didn't even realize Pronger was still on the team in 2014. What a weird ass shot. I didn't even realize he was still on the team in 2014. That, that is wild to me. Pronger was still on the team. I don't recall him being on the team. They have no shots on net yet. Oh, get laid out. Let's throw it on net. Keep this. Throw puck, puck in deep. They had no shot yet, and it's, uh, we're almost done the first period. Elite defense. What can I say? Oh, they're about to get one here after that turnover. Yep, here's their first shot. Big save by Steve Mason. Braden Coburn. He has high potential in this, too. Oh, uh, how the mighty the f has he fallen. And even, uh, make a fr but actually, that's what I was, that's what I'm planning on doing, actually. That's actually what I plan on doing. I just don't know what team to do. I was going to go through tonight and figure that out. But I actually do plan on doing that. Because I feel like if you're just going to do a sim series, you might as well just do like NHL 23. Like I already am doing. But like, you're definitely, first off, the gameplay Madden, Madden NHL 23 is so fucking boring. And it gets very repetitive. It, it really does. At least in this, it's fun. It's like... It's not fun in the current game. So, yeah, I am planning on doing a series with this. I just got to figure out what team. I mean, the Blue Jackets suck ass. The Flames would be interesting. Uh, the Blues would also be interesting. The Wild. Um, obviously, the Oilers. Neil Yakupov has still a very high potential and very good. I looked at his stats midway through this season. He's an absolute unit. I have to show you guys. Neil Yakupov. Oh, what a guy. Neil Yakupov. Absolute stud. Not even in the league no more. He, how quick did he get burned out? What was it? Two, three years? He didn't even last long. But in this, he's still very old. Oh my, he's got raped. He just got raped. Mazaros. Like, what the hell happened to him? I don't even know. I don't know where he even went. All right, come on, Voracek. <laughs> Voracek's a beauty. What a snipe. Top cheddar. Make that 2 nothing. That's... <laughs> I'm always scoring with Jake Voracek. Always scoring. Look at this. Right from the circle. Bang! I remember playing ESHL and I used to cheese the fuck out of just sniping right from this area. Boom! Goal every time. I used to be a unit on ESHL in this game. Absolute unit. Uh, when I was fucking 10 years old. Jesus Christ. Kimo Timonen still on... Well, I knew he's still on the team because he got traded 2015 to the Blackhawks. But he's like 39 years of age and he's... And he didn't get traded. We just didn't re-sign him. Got Luke Shen still. He's 24 years of age and has like a ton of potential too. Which is weird as well. No, I mean, he's had a nice career. He's still in the league playing. But like, they still have him like a high potential player. Hartnell? Oh, almost. Scott Hartnell is also a unit in this as well. Obviously, Andrew Cogliano, NHL 14 legend. I can lay him out. Get him, Shen. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Give it up. There we go. Deke. Cogliano. Here we go. Oh, look at the speed. Oh, I can't get around him, though. He's hanging on to the puck. Uh, as I say that. Giroux. Drew. Cogliano. Oh. I probably should have just threw it on with Giroux. Oh, that should be a turnover. Oh, I didn't mean to really do that, but okay. Just throw it up. Give it to Cogliano. Oh, we can't even get it. Okay. Okay. Oh, I almost got dangled. All right, come on, Braden Coburn. Give it up. Got your roof. Oh, here we go. We got a nice little fast break. I just used basketball terms. Oh, I could have had the... I could have got Voracek that hat trick right there. I easily could have. All right, Pax, you ready? Pax, you ready? Holy, what a shot. <laughs> what a shot. Was that... Who was that? That absolutely buried that on us. Was that Rene Bork? Absolute fucking clap bomb. Absolute heater. Look at that. <laughs> Mason stood no fucking chance. Steve Mason stood zero chance. Alright, well, it's a 2-1 game. And defensive collapse right there. It's, it is what it is. Max Paxi righty. Canadian's legend. P.K. Subban. Obviously, this is prime P.K. Subban as well. 
We got Matt Reed. Oh, Reed. Fuck. All right, Gustafson, give it up. This is the... F oh, no, it's still the third line. I was going to say, this is the goon line, but it's not the goon line yet. Oh, that was a dumb pass. Fucking throw it on. Well, Wood. Yes, sir. The celebrations in this game is also a lot better, but I'm still getting used to, like, the buttons for it. Because I keep hitting the same buttons all the time, and it keeps fucking it up. But eh, we're up 3-1 now. Rebound out in front, and just throw it right on in. Yes, sir. Look at that scrum. Carey Price couldn't control the rebound. Just right on in. Yeah, this is the goon line, the fourth line. Zach Ronaldo. Who remembers him? Absolute. He didn't do much off any offense, but he was always fighting, that guy. Always fighting. He's uh, very active on Twitter, if you have not seen his account. Time again. Oh, Ronaldo. Oh, we got a power. Four minute power play, the high sticking. Oh, the high. Oh, PK. You can't be doing that, buddy. Can't be doing that. We're going to score at least once here. We're, we have a top three power play. It's weird. And you look back at the old hockey. They have the two defenseman system on the power play. Now, sometimes teams don't even run any defenseman on the power. Well, some of their units. Placanic. Thomas Placanic. Oh, no. I just got shit on. Big save by Steve Mason. It's just weird how it's evolved. Giroux. Oh, Deke. Give it to Voracek. That's a goal. <laughs> Oh my god. Hat trick for Jacob Voracek. Throw the hats. What a deke by Giroux. Voracek buries it. Oh. Defense got caught napping. So did Carey Price out of position. There we go. We're shitting on him. Boom. Man, when I first played this game yesterday, I was struggling with the gameplay. I was getting my ass beat. Now it's the other way around. I've adjusted. I've relearned my ways of playing this game. All right, come on, Hartnell. Uh, let's give it to Coburn. Coburn. Ooh, back skate. Just throw it on. I've also noticed that, like, taking slap shots from the point, they also have a tendency to go in. Like, watch this. They they, they get to the goaltender. They get there. Oh, that's a probably a penalty. No, I didn't get one. Huh? That probably should have been interference, but I'll take it. All right, come on, Wainer. Wainer. Ooh. Let's throw it on. Oh, Maxime Talbot is almost with the head, but oh my god, look at Carey Price. <laughs> he's getting so much he's getting pressured hella. Alright, there we go. Hartnell. Hartnell. Talbot. Oh, that was a chance right there. That was a chance. And he just got butt fucked. <laughs> Fuck off. Get off me. Alright, Talbot, come on. Get the Voracek. He's already got three in this game. Give it to Giroux. Oh, Oh, Voracek just got it. That should be another penalty. He didn't have the puck and got hit. That's interference. Come on now. All right, throw it on. Oh, my cat wants in. Hold on. There we go. All right. Oh, I should have stole that. Absolutely. PK Subban. Look at him go. Prime PK. Stud. He was a stud back in his day. Oh. Give it up. Here we go. Got Giroux. Oh, that's actually Voracek. I don't know why I thought that was Giroux. Drop it back to Shen. Got Giroux. Giroux. Oh, that was a weird-ass shot, but still got on that. Hey. Oh, let's fight. Come on. Fight me, bitch. Fight me, bitch. Oh, you want to go? You want to go? Okay, here we go. We got some fighting here. Here we go. There's a lot more fights in this game than I was saying until 23, which makes sense. A lot more fighting at this period. In the NHL. Come on, bitch. Come on. No, I'm going to do it the old traditional way. Just for old time's sake. I know I know the buttons. Oh, fucking. Oh, we got him. We got him. Absolutely shit on. I just did the sticks for nostalgia. <laughs> you always had to use the sticks back in the day. Well, before 14, but like 13, 11, you had to use the sticks and just fucking go ham on them. What's up, Ninja Buggy? What's up? Braden Shen, five minute major for fighting. Oh, five minutes for 21 shots to four. They're absolutely getting no offense at all. Are we just that good or am I just that good? I don't know. It could be both. It could be both. This Flyers team's not that bad. But, like, I think if I. I'm curious to see how the game would be played. 
like how I would play it with like a shitty roster. Like, give me Columbus. I want to see how that goes. Like, am I still beating? Oh, okay. I didn't realize the period was over. But would I be still beating the fuck out of these teams? I might need to put sliders in. I might need to put sliders in. Because I think we'll do one more game before I throw sliders in. If I'm whooping their ass like real bad, I'm probably going to throw some sliders in there. Because I did find sliders, but I didn't want to throw them in yet. Because I just started playing this yesterday. So, Oh, that could have been a nasty goal. One question. How in NHL 4? You have to go into the settings. And it's just like menu music. You can just turn that all the way down and turn it off. All right, come on, Giroux. All right, just fucking slap shot. There we go. All right, board check. Good. Oh, oh, Giroux. Mm. Come on, I want to fight again. Fucking, come on. Drop the gloves, pal. Andrew Cock. Oh, get in there, Braden Coburn. Let's get a line brawl. Come on. There we go. PK Subban and Jacob Voracek. Sticks. Oh, no, no, I'm not using the sticks. I'm button smashing, though. Fucking hit him with an uppercut. Oh, missed him. He hit me with the uppercut, though. Pretty even fight. Some star players. Voracek with the hat trick. Is he going to get a Gordie Howe hat trick here? Come on now. Come on, Voracek. Don't lose this fight. Oh, he got hit hard. No, I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose. Fuck. <laughs> he ate shit. <laughs> oh, my God. He got pummeled. He absolutely ate that right hook. Look at how he flopped flops how many fights ha are you doing i've done two in this game and they're both in this third period <laughs> look how he fell look how he fell he ate shit he ate that whoa look at that eye look at pk's eye <laughs> pk ain't fucking around oh uh, oh uh. hey, that's my second fight of the game luke shen oh he just ate that one Brandon Gallagher, a young Brandon Gallagher. Oh my god, this cat. Make a decision. Get in or get out. Yeah, yeah shut up. If you go to that door again, we're going to have problems. Alright, come on, Matt Reed. Let's go. I'm going to do a slap shot. Why not? Oh. Wait. <laughs> oh, got a goal here. Oh, if he just faced the right direction, I mean, he would add a goal right there. Chemo, 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 chemo. Oh, lose the puck. Okay. Come on. Come on. Luke Shen. Brian Gianta. Oh, my. That's a name I haven't heard in a long time either. Brian. Oh, and he just died. Oh. Come on, Cogliano. Come on. Oh, Deke. Deke. Oh, and that's a penalty. Give me the power play. I'm doing PS3. Yeah, I just bought this yesterday. Well, I got it yesterday. I bought it, like, last Friday. You. Or whenever. Make a decision. Don't be asking to come back in, then. Don't be asking. Alright, let's get another power play goal. What, we have two power play goals? One? Two? Something like that. We had a four-minute major for high sticking because of PK. He's had a rough game. He's had a really rough game. Steve Mason's faced no pressure at all. Fucking grab the... Why is Zach Ronaldo on the power play? Kill him. Fucking Zach Ronaldo, all he does is fight. Get him off the power play. Let's just... Oh, I can't fight him. Can't fight him. Hmm. Damn, they're 9 for 15 on the face-off draws? Damn, okay. All right, Zach Ronaldo. Oh, good poke. Good poke. Come on, PK. What, why am I cheering for PK Subban? That, that don't make any sense. Grab the puck. Mike Calmary just dicked me down. <laughs> he undressed Steve Mason and just buried it back in the net. D man. <laughs> Copy in the bot. At least I think it's the bot. I'm not even sure if it's a bot or not. It probably is. It's a female. Let's be real. I've looked at my channel statistics. There ain't no females watching this at all. Let's be real here. Come on now. <laughs> there ain't none. Alright, like literally, it's like a 0%, I think, is the female demographic. Good. This amount of bitches I talk to. Zero. Alright, come on, Drew. Drew? Ooh, undress him. Oh, gotta go, gotta go. Braden Shen. <clears throat> That's a goal, baby. 5 2. Yes, sir. Let's go. I was using my. Oh. 
<laughs> I was gonna say, I didn't know if that's a bot because I already got a sex bot comment already. <laughs> I already got one, so I wasn't sure. You never know with those accounts. You never know. They always throw you for a curveball. But thank you. Love the support. Ah. Uh, what a goal. We're beating this shit out of the Canadian. This is a very big game for the playoff seating here because this is for a wild card spot, basically. We are one point off of the Canadians and we're absolutely beating the hell out of them. So that would be great. We're doing great right now. All right, come on, Hartnell. Hartnell, throw it on. Ooh, you're all good. Eh, you're all good. Mazaros from the point. Boom. Boom. Let's go. Six to two. I actually might need to put sliders on because the last game I played earlier. This morning I played before I we went to the gym. I won six one, so I might have to fix up the sliders, make it a little harder. I was struggling yesterday though. Oh, I will say I was struggling. I was very much struggling. I was playing on All Star and I was getting I choked. I choked to the Penguins. I, my first game of the year. I was not happy about it. I don't you never want to lose to the Penguins. Never. At least I don't. All right, come on, Drew. Turn on the Jets, pal. Let's go. Undress them. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Brian Gianta's got a two-on-one. He's got a trailer back there. Oh, he just threw it on. He didn't want to wait for him. Pocanic. Oh, good shit, Steve Mason. All right, got six minutes. We should be all right. We're not going to allow four goals, are we? Eh. At least I don't, I don't think we would. Four checks getting hit hard. Very hard. Get him off the puck. Come on now. Who is it? Who the hell is this? I don't remember this guy. Brandon Gallagher. I remember him. He's still in the league. Fuck you. Andrew Mazaros. Andre Mazaros. However you say his name. Alex Galchenyuk. When he was still at the Montreal Canadiens and actually had a lot of potential. What the hell happened to him? He, now he's just bouncing around team to team. He went from what? Montreal. Arizona. Toronto. Colorado. There's definitely another team I'm missing. Columbus? It's something along them lines. He's just bouncing around back somewhere. Team to team to team. He's just... Who knows? Facts. I'm a fellow Flyers fan and Claude Drew in the same line. Yes, sir. This is prime Drew, too. And he's prime Drew when he was a stud. A dog in his prime. Absolute beauty. Say it's a shame we never really got him the help that he needed. Like we never had the goaltending when he was here. We never really had that good teams because we're always in and out of playoffs. Either we're making it one year, miss the next, make it the one year, miss the next. It's, it was really not. We didn't really give him much help at all. It didn't help. Well, you could say it helped trading Mike Richards and Jeff Carter, but then because that brought in Voracek, that would also bring in Wayne Simmons. Also brought in who else? There was some other ones. But then you also traded Bobrovsky, who, you know, we gave up on him way too fast. Way, way too fast. I don't even know why we did that, but we did. Ooh. Come on, team it in. Team it in. I'm going to get one more goal. Here we go. Throw it on. Oh, carry price. Glove save. Almost. Almost. Well, we're going to win this one 6-2. That should help our playoff chances here. We should actually be in a playoff spot now after this. But we still have a little bit left of a season. Eric Gustafson shot blocked out in front, but it don't matter. Opinion on Hart? Or on the Hart Trophy? On Giroux. All right, there we go. Good stuff, boys. 6-2 win. And we're talking Carter Hart. Stud. Beauty. Absolute beaut. And, but here's the thing now. They love Sam Earson for, I mean, I guess, I wouldn't say for no reason because he's been playing good. But I have a fear. If Earson continues to play well, Hart could potentially see the door. I'm not saying it's going to happen, but I think it's a potential possibility. That's all I'm saying. Very much a potential possibility. Because they would get a shit ton out of Carter Hart. Just because Sam Harrison's had a nice little run doesn't mean, hey, you get rid of Hart or whatever. They better not. Ooh, big dub right there against Florida. 
big W. And we got big back-to-back -back doubleheader. That Buffalo game is actually really big. And Toronto. These are some big games here. And they're all pretty decent teams. Tampa Bay, not so great. Um, ooh, yes. Yes, scout assignment. The scouting in this game, I'm still learning. Uh, it is quite interesting compared to what we are used to now. Uh, if you do realize, it's the 2014 draft. So, you know who's in here, right? Leon Dreisaitl is in here, but I don't know why he's not popping up. Whatever, whatever. Pff, I don't know why he's not popping up. Um, Is it because he's not in the DEL, or is he in the DEL? I'm not even sure, to be honest. There's an Iserman. I'm learning the scouting. I have not done this in a long time. Casperi Kapanen, that's a name I recognize. We're going to scout this area here forwards. I don't know how many good goaltenders are in this draft class either, so I'm a little fucked here. Basically, going off my common NHL knowledge, if I just kind of recognize a player, I just kind of have to take them. All right, Toronto's been falling off a bit, but this is a big game here against Buffalo. So we're probably going to play that Buffalo game more than likely. Let's just show the standings real quick. We are still 12th. 9th. Yeah, Buffalo's ahead of us by two points, and we're also in a heated battle with Detroit and Montreal for the wild card. So this is going to be interesting, very interesting to see how this can go, because we're literally just right outside. All right, come on. We need at least split against Toronto and Boston. Preferably win both, but if we split, oh my God, that's an ugly loss. Ugly, ugly ass loss. We just can't lose to Toronto, and we lost to Toronto. Toronto haunts me. They very much haunt me. Sam Gagne in the Flyers franchise series. Oh, yeah. Speaking of Sam Gagne, he's lighting it up for uh, Edmonton in this. I've looked. I'm not happy about it. I really, If I get my chance to absolutely lay the fuck out of Sam Gagne whenever I play him, I'm going to take the chance. I'm definitely going to take the chance. All right. I want to show you guys Neil Yakupov because he's, he's doing actually really good. Oh, I went to the wrong spot. Go to player stats. Here we go. NHL load. Uh, it's, any, it's 360. Can't be asking a lot here. Edmonton. Where are they? Right there. Just look at this. Nugent Hopkins, 62 points. Sam Gagne, 23 goals, 35 assists, 58 points. I don't believe he was ever this good. Like 86 overall. Was he really that damn good? At, was he really that damn good? I, I don't recall him being that good. Neil Yakupov right here. 17 goals, 30 assists, 47 points. I don't even know if he ever touched over. Yeah, I don't even think yeah he ever ever got 40 points. I mean, he had 31 his rookie year. That's not that bad. It could be a lot worse. And then the Panthers just signed a whole. There's like a retirement team basically. Like Huberdeau still figuring it. He's listed as a center in this game. That is weird. He's no he's not even a center. Brian Campbell. Oh, that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Christopher Steg. Yarmir Yager when he was with the Panthers. And then Mike Richards. Mm -hmm. I just want to look at the Rangers. They absolutely suck in this. Uh, as well as the Islanders. And you got John Tavares who's lighting it up. Matt Molson, Kyle Pozo, Michael Grabner, Franz Nielsen, Andrew Mack. I hate this guy. Andrew McDonald. We overpaid for him and we had to buy him out. We had to buy him out. Rangers. Rick the Dick Nash, Brad Richards, Derek Brassard, a young Derek Brassard, Ryan McDonough, Derek Stepan. This is the year they went to the finals, too. This is the year. Mark Stahl, a 77 young Matt Zuccarello, Mark Streit. We traded him to New York because they gave me an offer for a first round pick for a guy that's 35 years of age and overpaid. I am definitely going to take that. I would be absolutely stupid if I didn't take that. I would have been dumb. All right, we got a big game here against Buffalo, the Sabres. Big, 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 big game. Uh, we're just going to wear the regular home jerseys here. C yeah, Coots is out for basically get McDavid. That means we have to suck, and good luck. I mean, we really did suck at the beginning of the year, but that means we're going to have to be really bad next year. Very bad. I don't know if that's going to happen, though. <laughs> I don't think we're going to be that bad because you still have Giroux as much I trust me. I was praying for us to suck ass so bad because we were really bad at some point where I really thought, okay, we're going to be tanking for our Conor McDavid next year. I thought that was a very realistic possibility. 
that that did not happen. No, 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 that did not happen at all. Pick up long. I mean, he is a free agent at the end of the season, so it is possible. We do need goaltender. We got Tim Thomas in that this game. We got Timmy Thomas. Oh shit! Neat, neat, neat. Sabers and Flyers. It's weird seeing the Sabers be this good when we know in real life they were nowhere near this good. They were in the midst of the first rebuild out of the what? How many? Two or three? They've had. Yeah, they've had many rebuilds and one rebuild. Many. Boo! Get them the fuck off the ice. Yeah, Tim Thomas. We signed him through free agency. All right, let's go, boys. We need a big win here. This is for a playoff spot, basically. Going against the Sabers, we dropped our last two. Not, not helping us a lot. If we miss playoffs, we really need to assess this team because I don't know what to do at that point. Because we just can't be stuck being mid. Because that's what the Flyers were at this. Giroux. Claude Giroux with an absolute snipe. Make it one nothing. A minute and 15 seconds into the game. What a snipe by Claude Giroux. Captain. Captain Claude. Oh, look at this absolute burry. Boom. Standing no chance. Already put us up one nothing. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stuff here. All right, come on. Already got the second line out there. Damn. Tyler Ennis. He's still in the league. He's just a lot younger here. All right, Cogliano, look at the Jets. Look at the Jets he's going to about to put on. Deke. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my. He got an absolute scent right there. Hartnell. Oh, where did he? Is that Nathan Gerber? Oh, okay, come on. Wayne Simmons, lay him out. Oh, or, or that. Is that Mar Nick Felino or Marcus Felino? That might be Marcus. It's one of the two. I know that. Right, Cogliano, we're just going to take a slap shot here. Oh, <laughs> look at this. Andrew Cogliano, snap shot from left side circle. Put us up 2 nothing early in this game. I might need harder sliders. I might need to put some sliders on. Look at this absolute slap shot. Boom, stood no chance. What are you going to do? Basically had his thumb up his ass. He can't grab that. No, sir. -y. Boom, right off his shoulder. Right off his shoulder. Not even 10 minutes into the game we're already up to. This might be an ass whooping. This very much might be an ass whooping. Just like the Montreal game. At least they have a shot out already. Montreal didn't get one until like the last minute of the first period. We're four five one in our last ten. That's not ideal, but is what it is. Braden Shen. The Mazzaro slap shot. Oh. Good chance right there. Josh Leno. He used to be isn't it, he used to be on the Flyers? I think so. At least I think. Oh, oh, uh oh, oh. Yep, and he scored. There's gonna be no defense this game, ain't there? No defense, no goaltending, straight offense. I think that's what the way that direction this game's going. Billy Leno. See, he was for the Flyers. Why did I call him Josh Leno? I was thinking of somebody else. It's Billy. Yeah, he did play for the Flyers. See, I'm not tripping. I, I knew. I knew it. Their bottom six is just as bad as ours. Actually, a lot worse than ours because I got Cogliano. Would, if we had Couturier actually playing, not hurt, it would be a lot better. But we're suffering from success. Well, that's actually not success. He's just hurt. All right. Gustafson, slap shot. Ooh, that was a little bit of a... Weird shot, but it works. Come on, give me the puck. Come on, Wellwood. Eric Wellwood with the puck around the net. You got Matt Reed. Ooh, almost, almost, almost. I had the chance. That's a goal. Went in the back of the net. Billy Lino, 50 career goals. Good for him. Good for Billy. Yeah, I think he's on the first line for the Sabres. Yeah, he is. He is with Drew Stafford, I think that is. Oh, my. These are names I haven't heard in a long time. Oh. Lay him out. Nah, weak hit. Oh my god. Billy Lano, Deke. Billy Lano's turning into Wayne Gretzky. Look at him. It's a 2 2 game. Yep, there is going to be no no defense. None whatsoever. His second goal of the game. 11 goal of the season. Look at the look at the Deke. I mean, whew. Damn. I wasn't expecting that. Sheesh. I got undressed. Damn. All right, well, we got ourselves a game here in Philly. 
Okay, let's go. Gerby. Oh, that could have been a turnover. If Hartnell just put a stick out there. Put the stick out there. That's a steal. And he's dead. Chemo teaming it up to Hartnell. Bad pass. Bad pass. All right, teaming around the net. Luke Shen. Oh, boy. Get the Hartsy. Here we go. All right, got Cogliano coming up with him. Get the Cogliano. Just throw it on. Oh, there we go. Andrew Cogliano for the second snipe. Actually, he had a slap shot for the first one. But an absolute snipe by Cogliano. Make it 3-2. to two. <sighs> Holy shit. Look at this snipe. Boom. Bar down. Look at that. Look at that. Andrew Cogliano. Stud. How many goals are we thinking is going to be scored this game? Giroux. He almost had his second right there. Get the Mazzaros. Slap shot. Oh, out of play. Lay him out. <laughs> that ain't Shea Weber back there. He didn't play for the Sabres unless he got traded. I don't think he did. He was still in Nashville at this point, right? Yeah, he was. Yeah, no, because Nashville's good. They didn't trade him. No, no, no. It's somebody else. Is that Brady McNabb? And that's a 3-3 game. Tim Thomas is not saving a thing this game. Okay, well, this might be like a, a 8 to 9 game. This and the way it's going, it might be 98 game. It really might be. All right, where do I make line changes? Team management, edit lines. Yep, he's coming out. He's coming out. Where is Steve Mason? Get his ass in the game. This is a very pivotal game of the season. It's already 3 3. We're not even over with the first period yet. We can still be ending up 4 4, 5 3, whatever the hell. Or it could just end 3 3. But Steve Mason's going to get out there. Tyler Myers. What the fuck happened? What happened? What? 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 <laughs> Tim Thomas just run out the net and say, fuck it. I had enough of this shit. Did he just run off the ice? That son of a bitch just run off the ice. Hold on, hold, hold, hold the phone, hold the phone, hold on, no way, he just, did. <laughs> what, I didn't pull the goalie, I didn't pull him, I just swapped him out, they would usually do that, you know, once play is stopped, but he just took off the ice, he just said, fuck it, I'm going to the bench, <laughs> he hate waiting each year <laughs> to make the same game, but with better graphics. Uh, Tim Thomas just went off the ice and said, fuck it. He had enough of it. He he had enough. He had enough of being scored on three times. He just took it straight to the bench and said, Go, get in there, Steve. Get in there. Oh, no. This is not good. This is Now we're down four to three. Okay, can I like back out now? Okay. We've seen enough. Tim Thomas just ran off the ice. He had enough. Drew Stafford scored made it a 4-3 game. This is quite the display of hockey, ain't it? There is... This is something. At least Steve... Hopefully he won't run off the ice. I didn't pull him. I guess if you just swap them, they just start running. And they'll switch out like a line change mid-play. Okay. I didn't know that. Well, now I do. All right, come on, Brandon Coburn. Oh, big save there by Steve Mason. See, Tim Thomas would have allowed that to go into the net. All right, come on, Voracek. Deke. Oh, just throw it on. Oh, almost. Almost. Come on now, get him off the puck. Let's go. Oh, oh. Five seconds remaining. Just just hit him, please. Oh, no. Oh, no. Big save by... Yep. Let's get it out of there. All right. End of the first, it is four to three. That That's something. This is quite the hockey game. Yeah, I mean, this is something. Four to three. All five guys must help out defensively. <laughs> You're not kidding. There ain't much defense. Uh, well, they had eight shots. Four of them went in. Not ideal. I need to go to the bathroom and fill up my water bottle. So I'll be right back. Uh, Tim Tom, I'm I'm still fathoming what happened with Tim Thomas. Uh, I mean, like I'm going to watch an AHL game today. I got the Providence Bruins. I don't know anyone on the Providence Bruins. I can't help you with that either. Is Fabian Mysell on the Bru Providence Bruins? It, is he? Or is he back in, uh... What is he, Finland? 
Back in Finland? Is he in the is he in Providence or is he in Finland? At this point. I know he was just at the World Juniors and did nothing. I know that, but yeah, he might you might see him there. I don't think he's in the AHL, but there's a chance. I'm pretty sure he's still in Finland, if I'm correct. Playing in the Liga. If I'm correct. I think so, but I'll be right back. We back. We back. We back. We back. All right. Let's get this second period going. Hopefully. <laughs> can't believe Tim Thomas. He just said, eh, I'm done. I'm done for the day. He just ran off the ice. Then he wait for you now. Do you play ice hockey or any? Nope. Never have. I've always wanted to. Never have. I never got the opportunity. I wish I did. I never did. There was, like, I would have if I never moved. And I moved, and there's no, like, hockey stuff near me. So, no. As much as I wish, I do not. I've not, I've, I've gone to, like, rinks, like, outdoor rinks, like, street hockey, ball hockey, whatever you call it. I've gone there and just shot around. Like, I have a stick in the net and everything. Oh, what a snipe. That's a 4-4 game. Like, I have a stick in the net, and I'll shoot around, but, like, I've never actually played. Never played. Should join a beer league. <laughs> Should join the beer league. I don't even know. Where would be the closest beer league to me? I actually gotta look that up. I'm actually really interested now. <laughs> Where would be the closest beer league hockey I could do? I don't even know how to skate. I don't even know how. Never even attempted to skate. Maybe that's something I should try. Maybe learn how to skate. Put some skates on. Become Connor McDavid. Watch all of his film. Learn all the lessons. Study. Oh, is that Ryan Murray? I think that's Ryan Murray. I, I, did he get drafted to Buffalo? I'm trying to remember. I'm not even sure. Oh, Tyler Ennis just deked the hell out of Luke Shen. All right. Oh, 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 boy. Oh, boy. All right, Ennis. Just hit Wayne. Just hit him, Wayne. Just come on, hit him. All right, come on, Hartnell. Get to Cagliano. All right, Cagliano. What the fuck? Come on. Oh, we got Holly oh, at Kimo. Oh, Voracek. Four check goal. Oh, that was a chance. Oh, give it right to me. Thank you. Oh, and we lost it. Yeah, it's just uh, shit. Mazzaros. No, we're not letting Billy Leno get a hat trick. No. No. <laughs> that puck just went flying straight out. How do you not grab that? If Tyler Myers scored right there, I would have been pissed. All right, Matt Reed, let's go. Let's go, Matt Reed. You got Maxime Talbot with you? Just throw it on. 
Matt Reed. Ooh. Oh, grab the puck. Oh, took you a little while there. And he got butt fucked. <laughs> All right, come on, Eric Wellwood. Got Talbot. Oh, I could have had maybe Matt Reed there for a moment. <laughs> right in the ass. Oh, Grossman. Boom! The defensive defenseman snipes it bar down. Now it's a 5 4 game. <laughs> There's just zero defense. Just zero. Nicholas Grossman. That's also a name I haven't heard in a long time. And look at him go. He's doing some justice right there. Stud. Absolute stud. What a snipe. Here we go. 5 to 4. Yes, sir. All right, come on. I'm dump it on in, I guess. Okay. Grab the puck, please. Oh, or don't. That just works just fine, I guess. Four check. Oh, shot block. Come on, get it, get it, get it, get. It. Toughen it up. Not gonna let Brady McNabb just shit on you like that. No, 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 no. This is before actually good McNabb when he went to Vegas. Oh, come on, Shen. Let's throw it on. Ooh. Oh, wait. Come on. Still fight for it. Come on now. Oh, God. Let's keep back, shit. Oh, oh. Billy Leno with the puck. Around, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Do not let him score another one. Do not. Big save there, I see Mason. Look at him. We've, we've held it down ever since he came in. Stud. All right, come on, Giroux. Giroux with the puck. Giroux. Snipe. Oh, Cagliano just go. Oh, oh, my. Oh, my God. There's so much turmoil out in front. Simmer. Shot. Oh, big save by an Okay, that was, that was almost scary for Buffalo. Good for me, but scary for them. Gerby. Oh, he just threw it right on. What's your favorite team? Flyers. It's right in the username. Oh, boy, big save. It's the Flyers. Uh, Come on, Hartnell. Come on, Hartnell. All right, Wainer. Come on, Wainer. They're doing good right now, which is weird. Now, how long is this going to last? Another week, at most. I see them going back to reality. They're playing over their head. Well, Konechny is just carrying the team, basically. He's the best player. They're playing a little too good. I wish they would lose. I really wish they would lose. We want Bedard. I want Bedard, though. I want Bedard. And we need to lose so Chuck Fletcher gets fired because he's keeping his job right now with the way they're playing. Lately, past week or so, two weeks. We need him to lose. Just stop winning. Please just stop winning. Just do us a favor. Just stop winning. They just need to stop. It, you're hurting ourselves. We need Bedard or Fantilli or Mitch Goff or Leo Carlson. One of the four would be fantastic. Jaeger wouldn't be bad either. He wouldn't be bad. No, no, no. Not at all. All right. Five to four. 20 minutes remaining. This is a big, big, big game. All right, come on, Billy Leno. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Don't let him get near that net. Yeah, good shit, Mazaros. Good stuff. Come on, Giroux. Claw true. Slap shot. Right here. Ooh, almost. Mine is the Boston Bruins. Brad Marchand is a rat. He is a rat. He is a rat. But I, I like him a lot more now than I used to. I, I do like him a lot more now than I used to. Still, not crazy for him, but... I like him more, a little bit. More likable. Damn, Cogliano just got bitched. Oh, come on, Hartnell. Oh, and okay. All right, Gerby, Gerby. Dump and chase, dump and chase. Oh, or missed the puck. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Good. Do oh, chemo team didn't lane the body, huh? Oh, fanned on it. Come on, Hartnell, Hartnell. Let's go. This is just scuffed gameplay right now. This is scuffed. Oh, no. The Marcus Foligno. The Gerbe. We're not going to act like we just witnessed that possession at all. We're just not going to talk about it because that was nasty. That was ugly. That was not pretty at all. We're just not going to talk about it. No, 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 no. We're simply not going to talk about it. It was terrible. It was terrible. No one saw anything. No, no. No, no. You didn't see nothing. Nothing. Alright, come on, Shen. Got Giroux. Giroux! Ooh! Alright, come on. 
Voracek around the net. Just throw it on. Oh, come on, Drew. That could have been a chance. Come on. Oh, Braden Shen. Oh, and he just got beat down. No. Scott Ott. I think that's, is that his name? I don't even know. Slap shot. Big save there by Mason. All right, come on. Come on, Giroux. Let's go. Come on, Deke. Oh, 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 oh. Or not. Or not. Get a line change. Get fresh legs out there. Come on. Get, get off the ice, Voracek and Giroux. Just get off. Tyler Myers with the puck. Tyler Myers. Throw it on. Missed the net. a boy. Talbot. Oh, no. He got murdered. That's a murder. Matt Reed. Ooh, he fight for it. Opinion on Crosby. Hate him. Simple as that. Hate him. I have flashbacks. That's all I can say. I get flashbacks in 2012. Well, we beat his ass in 2012, I should say. That's good flashbacks, but there's many flashbacks I've seen where he's shit on us. So, do not like the Penguins. Simple as that. <laughs> so that means I hate Sidney Crosby. Simmons, oh, big chance right there. Kimo teaming in. Come on, teaming in. Let's go. Oh, he, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, at least we had someone back. That's Hartnell. All right, good. All right, come on, Kimo. Penguins are probably my least favorite sports team out of any sport. They're probably my least favorite, I think, by a decent margin. He, by a decent margin. I think the Penguins are easily my most hated. Cowboys are right there with them, though. Cowboys are not too far behind. I, I absolutely despise the Cowboys as well. Eagles fan, of course. Oh, oh my. That was that was a close one. That was close. That was close. Come on, just, come on let's go. Come on, Hartnell. Let's go. Got Shen. Get to Shen. Hartnell. Uh, well, I don't know what to do. Oh, Hartnell. Hartnell. Oh, no. That was a chance right there. Shen. He missed the puck. He fanned. It went right by him. No. All right, come on, Nick Grossman. He got murdered. No. Oh. What? You kidding me? No way. Six to five. Steve Ott just buried one. Oh, no. No. No, that is not good. That is not ideal. That is not ideal at all. Rhode Island, I'm assuming. Bruins are close enough. You guys are pretty close to the Bruins. And I think, what, the Rangers as well? You're not too far from them. So it's not too bad. At least you're not, like, far. Like, I live two and a half hours away from the Flyers. Oh, come on, Shen. Oh, come on, Giroux. Oh, come on, not. Come on, can we just get them off the puck? Please, we have 15 seconds. Oh, no, 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 no. Billy Lano just got the hat trick. Billy Lano just scored a hat trick on me. Well, our playoff chances are a little hurt, and this offseason, if we miss, is going to be very interesting. Because this would be the second straight year, because if you remember, 12 to 13, the Flyers missed the playoffs. And this would be the second straight year, and I think there definitely needs to be a shakeup with the core. Be put me out of my misery. Just, just put me out of my misery, please. Just put me out of my misery. Cup predictions. <sighs> that, that's tough because I can see it going many ways. I can see I. Boston definitely looks like the team of destiny right now, but President's Trophy teams choke in the playoffs. You gotta remember that, and something. Listen, I think the Bruins have a great chance, but I don't know. I mean, in the West, it's just such a toss-up because no, it's going to be a champ coming out the East. It's going to be somebody out of the East. I genuinely believe, this is crazy to say, I believe Toronto can do it this year. If Toronto gets past the first round, they're winning the Cup. I'm calling it now. If Toronto gets past the first round, they win the Cup. I'm saying it right now. Whatever year it may be. Actually, no. Because this could be like 30 years from now. And they win to get past the first round. If the Maple Leafs get past the first round this year. And that's a tall order. Because they're going to be playing the Lightning more than likely. They're going to be playing the Lightning. 90% chance. They're going to be playing the Lightning again. So if they get past them. I believe they can beat Boston. And I think Toronto can go on to win the cut. 
I'm not saying they're going to. I don't know if I'm going to stick with that gut. I'm just saying if they get past the first round, they might they they win the cup. At least that's what I think. Boston is playing the best they ever had in a long time. Yes, they are, but playoffs it could become completely different. And are they peaking at the wrong time? That's also another thing because they did just get their ass beat by Seattle. That is true. I'm not trying to shit on them, but they did just get their ass beat. But hey, that's only one game. They have Matthews, yes. They also have Mar- Mitch Marner playing over his head right now. They Marner's playing over his head. Neil Lander's playing fantastic. They're getting great defense out of missing many defensemen. They're getting good goaltending this year out of Samsonov and Matt Murray. I mean, if they keep it up, I'm just saying the Leafs have a chance. The Leafs have a chance. That's all I'm going to say. All right, we need a big win here. We're going to sum up this Rangers game on the third. If we lose to the Lightning, this is going to hurt us big time. Out of the West, it's just a shit show. Uh, I mean, you could probably say the Avalanche when they get together, but they're playing so bad right now. So, Drew Doughty, uh, Hall of Famer. It's just, I don't really have a strong opinion on him, but he's probably a Hall of Famer, at least. I would think he'd be a Hall of Famer. All right, come on. Get past this Toronto game. This is beat Toronto, please. This is a big game. We need to win here, and we lose to Toronto. They own me. They own me. They literally own me. We got big games here against the Caps. Two games. We have two games against the Penguins, and two games against the Rangers here in the late stretch. How many times have we played the Penguins? Only four times, right? Because we played them twice early in the year. I think you only play them four times. Yeah, you only play them four times, and they bunched them together, which is weird, but whatever. What's what are we looking at right now? Record or playoff wise? What are we looking at? What are we looking at? Standings. We're sixteenth. The East is a lot stronger than the West. We're sitting. The Islanders have jumped us. The Islanders. Yikes. Okay. Well, this is just not ideal. Not at all. <laughs> this is just not ideal. Uh, the Metro. Yeah. This is not looking good. <laughs> This is not looking good for playoffs. I mean, we still have six games remaining. I don't know how to feel about this. We have to win these next two against the Rangers. We have to at least win one of these. We have to win at least one of these against the Rangers and Penguins. If we don't, I think season's over. I, I believe the season's over if we don't win at least one of these. All right, we do beat the Rangers 6-5. to five. They suck, so that's good. And the Penguins, two clutch Ws right there. And then we got the Caps. Then we got the Penguins again. Then the Rangers. Okay. We're going to send this Capitals game. They're in hell right now. 29. What is that? 29, 36, and 13? Hell of a year for them, ain't it? Oh, Eric Wellwood. This replaced player. Cup final team prediction. <sighs> Pull up the standings right quick. <laughs> I, I mean, in the West, I, I'm... I, it's so hard to say out west. It really is. I, I mean, none of these teams really... I look at them and say cup contending teams out in the west. I don't see any. I really don't. Like the Avalanche? I'm going to say Colorado. I still think they get it together. They're not even in a playoff spot. But I think they'll get it together. Colorado versus... Carolina. Fuck it. Colorado versus Carolina. Oh my god, I just butchered that. Hurricanes versus Avalanche. I think something's going to happen with the Bruins. I can't commit to my gut with the Leafs. I can't do it. As much as I want to, I can't. What a win right there. As we would lose to the Caps there in the other one, but it's whatever. I, I, would, I would have to say Hurricanes, yeah. I, I, I can't pull the trigger on anything else, so... I'll go Hurricanes Avalanche. Like, what Western team? Maybe Vegas. That was the only other one I could think of. Vegas? Like, you're going to say the Stars? I mean, they have Ottinger. They're not bad. Don't get me wrong, but are they really a cup contending team right now? I don't know about that. I mean, to be fair, the West is very weak, so I can definitely see them make the finals. But, like, the West is so bad. It's just so bad. Even the Avalanche aren't playing good. The Oilers, they... I mean, this if. The Oilers got their shit together. This is the year to go to the finals. This is literally the year. The Avalanche are playing bad. The star- I mean, the best team in the West is Vegas. And they've had their issues. So it's like... 
They're tanking for Bedard. San Jose. They're tanking for Bedard. At least they... they're. If Bedard goes to San Jose, that'd be interesting. That'd be pretty interesting. I just hope he doesn't go to Chicago. Him and Columbus, though. Nah, not anymore. They don't have Flurry. They got what? Logan Thompson and Robin Lehner. And Lehner's hurt. Do you really trust the goaltending for Vegas in the playoffs? No, I don't. At least, I don't. I, it's just risky. I mean, I don't know if I really see... I just have to go with Colorado. Like, what other team? I'd have to go Dallas, Vegas, Colorado, probably. It's going to be one of those three. I can't see anybody else. Unless the Oilers got their shit together. I would say Oilers, but they are struggling. Are Bruins gone? That's my favorite. What do you mean, are they gone? Oh, we're back up in the left. Are we in a playoff spot right now? We are, but I think we can easily choke it because we're two points up on Buffalo. Two point oh, this is easy. This is easily doable of a choke. Bruins, yeah, they they've this is the best they're playing in a very long time. Very, 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 very long time. I re- Do we play this Penguins game or the? I'm gonna play the Rangers game. If we lose to the Penguins, that would suck. All right, we need to beat the Pens. Beat the Pens. We need to win this game. Oh, we're got, we're playing this Rangers game. We're playing the Rangers. We lose three to one. This is just getting. This is flashbacks to 2010. Lat came down to the last game of the year. The Rangers not being good. Us, we need to win to make the playoffs more than likely. Buffalo got in over us. Voracek, love him. Love Jake Voracek. Yep. It's between us and Montreal for the last playoff spot. Last season they lost like every game. Yeah, I mean, well, I actually. Last year, I had Boston going to the Eastern Conference Finals because I really liked their path because I thought, okay, who would they play first round? I'm trying to remember. Last year. Was it Carolina? Yeah, they played Carolina. I actually had them beating Carolina because I thought they could. They played good. Then they lost in, what, six? And then they would have played the Rangers. And I, I was very confident that if the Bruins played the Rangers, they could beat them. But they didn't. So they didn't play them. Anyone know? Oh, I didn't even realize that. Well, now I do. <laughs> Did not even know that. Picked up on NHL this month. Uh, okay, so you're new to hockey. Well, welcome to the sport. Very interesting. <laughs> now I'm pissed off. YouTube ain't giving me no Flyers notification. YouTube bugging. They be bugging, ain't they? Yeah, well, it's all coming down to this. We have to beat the Rangers. It's very esque of 2010. We have to win this game to get into the playoffs. We have to get in. Very esque of 2010. This is very, very 2010 esque. If it goes to a shootout, this is an exact carbon copy. Let's see what re- jerseys they had at this time. They had the old alternate. I remember when they used to wear these. The 2011, 2012 Winter Classic jerseys. I uh, was wear the classic blue, and we'll go against them here. This is the second time I played them. All right. We still, if we make playoffs, we get Contaria back, right? We should get Contaria back for playoffs. Or at least at some point if we win. If we win this game, we make playoffs. We'd be the 8th seed. Taking on... Would we be taking on Boston? Actually, I want to go look. I want to go look. I want to look at all scenarios before we get into this game. Because we can lose and Montreal gets in over us. Yeah, Couturier would be back. I feel like... Where I live. <laughs> like, I'm just... What, what are we looking at? Who would we be playing? Would it be Boston? Would it be... Tampa's doing really good. So, yeah, there's no way in hell they're trading Martin St. Louis. We'd be playing Carolina. So, if we win this game, we play Carolina first round. How? Who does Carolina have? Didn't in real life at this point, weren't they bad? Weren't they rebuilding or starting? Hold on. I got to go look. I think this is when they were really bad. How are they the best team in the league? Yeah, wait a minute. This, this don't make sense. This does not make sense. I don't think they were good in 2014. NHL 2013-14 standings. Let's see. Eastern Conference. Yeah, no, they were not good. 36, 35, and 11. Who do they even have? <laughs> this is a very damn good question. Why? Oh, oh, I know what I want to do. I want to go view lines. That's what I want to look at. View lines, view lines, view lines, view lines. See what Carolina's got cooking. Oh, uh, okay, I see what you mean. 
Carolina. Let's see. Jeff Skinner. Oh, that's right. Eric Stahl. Okay, they're very good on paper. I can actually see why they're good. Yeah, Rutu. Third line. LaRose. Lee Stampinick. Why are you playing at 14, not 23? I think it's in the title. 23 is bad. And I don't... It's just boring and repetitive. Need to spice up. 14 is a lot more fun. At least in my opinion, at least. They have a really good top six. They just traded for Stemp... Stempinock? How the fuck you say his name? I don't know how to say his last name. They got Zach Boychuk, uh, Riley Smith. I think that's nice. I think that's who it is. Uh, defensively, they're not even that strong. I think we can upset them first round. I think it's very doable. If if we even, we have to win this game first, we have to win this game first. Cam Ward, that makes sense. Okay, I can see why they're good. But President's Trophy good? Cam Ward was a stud back in his day. He was very good. But President's Trophy. I don't know, but good for them. All right, let's play this game. We need to win this. We need to beat the Rangers. If we want any chance, we need to win. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> Ryan McDonough, Brad Richards, Ryan Callahan. <laughs> what a shitter. <laughs> Just look at this presentation. Just look at this. Let's take a listen. Lungfist is not even playing. <laughs> They're tanking. They want Aaron Eckby, don't they? And Sam Reinhardt. They made the finals this year, too, in real life. That's the crazy part. EA Disson. They made the finals. And they're going to miss playoffs. You know, EA's always been bugging with their sim engine. This just gave me a reminder. They've always been bugging. Always bugging. Well, to be fair, if this they don't have Martin St. Louis. B-Ron? Oh, my. Martin Brim, B-Ron. Goaltender for the Rangers. Holy shit. Scotty, what, 37, 38 years old at this point? Gotta be. There's no way he's nothing else. He's old. Oh, Rick Nash. All right. Yeah, they do have Rick. They don't have St. Louis yet, though. Oh, shot. Big save there by uh, B-Ron. Get him off the puck. Come on. Ryan McDonough. Prime Ryan McDonough. Got Steve Mason in that. And again, this is a very important must-win game for us. Got to remember that. Ryan Callahan. Girardi. Ooh, okay. Here we go. Give it up to Giroux. Now back to Voracek. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, Brad Richards. Eat shit, pal. Oh, no. Zuccarello. This is a young Matt Zuccarello. Big save. Another big save. Is Panarin in this game? I actually should look after this game if they have Artemi Panarin. Like as a high development player or not. Because he did come up like out of kind of nowhere. So I don't even know if he's in this game. I want to go look. Because he was drafted by this point. He just wasn't in the league yet. That was the next year. 14-15. Because they had... Yeah, Gossip Spare is not even in the game. And he won. He was a Rookie of the Year contender that year. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Big save. Mason. 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 Ma oh, Steve Mason. What a save. Oh, my. Look at Steve Mason go. Look at him. That was a scary moment right there. All right. Can I just please fight? Fight me, bitch. Come on. Oh, you pussy. Come on. There's 6-2. Oh, the Rangers are buzzing right now, too. This ain't ideal. No, 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 no. This is not ideal. They're actually doing good. No, 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 no. Grossman, oh. Sit down. Don't even shoot the puck ever again. 
No, my watch. Oh, and Talbot just got stripped off. Okay. Joe Colborn right here with the puck. Come on. We might have him. We might have him. There we go. There we go. one nothing. Huge, huge goal to give us the lead. We got this guy off of waivers. Joe Colborn, seventh of this season. He just came in for the injured, what, Wellwood? Yeah, Wellwood was hurt. He was the one that was hurt. Big goal right there. All right, it puts us up 1-0. Hopefully, we get a little bit of a better defense this time around than uh, what we got last time against Buffalo. If you guys didn't see the Tim Thomas master class, oh boy, you you are missing out. Especially just ran off the ice and let Buffalo score. That actually cost us the game. That literally lost us the game. Literally lost us the game. I, I still, I'm still fathoming him just running off the ice. Just saying he's done. I didn't even pull him. Well, no, I swapped him out. But I didn't think he would actually do like a line change mid-game. Like, <laughs> I ain't real. I didn't think he would. And well, he did. All right, come on, Kimo. All right, come on, Cogliano. Cogliano. Oh, here we go. Well, that's a... I, well, it wouldn't have mattered. It wouldn't have counted. It would have been goaltender interference, but I couldn't even throw it on net, at least. All right, we need to reset. Get a line change out here. I mean, that's not a line change, but I guess, okay. Uh, around the net. A little too much sauce on it, but it don't matter. mazzaro has got it. Bailed him out. Get to Coburn. One time. Off the post. No, 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 no. Come on, Cogliano. Ooh, skirt. Oh, Cogliano. Cogliano. Oh, he's going to get shit on. Lay him out. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Colburn getting his second. Oh, almost. He could have had it right there. 4.8 seconds left. Oh. Well, we're hanging on. There's a lot more defense this game. A lot more than what it was with Buffalo. A lot more. All right, win this draw. Win this draw. Grossman, throw it on. Oh, big save by B-Ron. Oh, how much time is left? Like, one, not even one second. Point nine. And uh, what was the point? This should just let it go. Let the clock run, basically. I mean, what are you going to do with point nine of a second? Nothing. Nothing. All right, let's look at the stats. Shot. They have more shots than us. So we're getting outplayed. Uh, not really. Time on attack is way in our favor. 406 to 150. Our third passing percentage is way better, but that's also because they've had the puck less, to be fair. We've been moving it around a lot. All right, let's win this draw. Dan Girardi. All right. And Callahan got... <laughs> I played the Rangers, I think, what was it, yesterday? Yeah, I played them yesterday, and I laid out Ryan Callahan. He got taken out of the game. They had to stop the game because he was so badly injured. <laughs> you don't see that that much anymore in uh, NHL 23. The guy gets leveled so hard, he's just they have to stop the game. And he's just done. He's just laying there, kind of dead. Poor guy. I kind of felt bad a little bit, but I was also laughing. So I don't feel bad. Best 10 of all time, Dominic Hasek. Dominic Hasek, easy. Brodor just kind of feed it off a great defense. Still still top three all the time, but like Brodor fed off that defense with Scott Stevens and everything. Can't act like he didn't. Hasek didn't have much, and then when he went to the Red Wings, he got that cup. So I'm going to say Hasek, and plus the, just watch some of his highlights. Absolute crazy. Yeah, it's definitely Hasek, at least in my opinion it is. Come on, Cogliano. Come on. Cogliano. What a shot. There we go. Look at that. Selly. <laughs> 2 nothing lead. All right, we're playing real good right now. This is reminding me of 2010. Getting them 2010 flashbacks. Same name as him. What, Dominic? I would assume it would be Dominic. Hashik's a rare name. Coburn. Woo. Laid out. See you later, pal. Oh, good turnover there by Rick Nash. Just not hat. Yeah, I figured that. I know a lot of Doms. One buddy Dom used to play basketball with at the basketball courts. Yeah, he's going through it right now. <laughs> Poor Dommy. Come on, Mazaros. Oh my, there goes the bottle. There goes the bottle. 3 nothing. 
Three nothing halfway through the third. I think we got this wrapped up, boys. Andre Mazaros. Look at that slap shot from the point. There goes the bottle. There it goes. Forjack had the duck. He almost got his head taken off with that one. Brian Boyle. Oh. Mark Streit. We traded him to the range. I hope the Rangers are trash next year. Because we have their pick. If the Rangers are terrible. That trade will go down as one of the biggest fleece jobs of all time. I already put it down as one of the greatest fleece jobs of all time. We got rid of a 35 year old making 5 mil a year for 4 years. At 35 years of age. And <laughs> make it 4. <laughs> make it 4 nothing. <laughs> this is just an ass beating. They need Lundquist in the game. b -Ron can't save nothing. Well, looks like we're making the playoffs. So we're going to be playing Carolina. That's what it looks like to me. At least that's what it looks like. Braden Coburn, where are they showing? Some hits? Yep. <laughs> Well, this is great. This is great stuff. Great stuff. I would back out, but I'm afraid. I don't know if I backed out. It would it, is it just like the current NHL games where it'd be like it just sims from where you are and you'd probably still win? I'm, af I'm afraid to do that. I want to, but I'm afraid because they might give me the loss. No one. I don't know how. I don't remember what it was like back then with that. Simmons. Ooh. Oh, missed the net. Okay. I mean, not the net, but missed whoever it was. I don't even know. What am I talking about? Who knows? Girardi? Ooh, big save there. Look at Steve Mason. Brick wall back there. Oh, no. Oh, look at that. Big save. Come on, Cogliano. Let's go. Get up to Wainer. Here we go. Deke. Ooh. Ooh. On dry some. Oh, Hartnell just ate that one. Oh. We don't need you hurt. We need you, Hartnell, for playoffs. We need that physicality. And oh, oh, oh. Come on, Kimo. Go to Drew. Got Shen, the tr follower. Oh, Vorchek. Oh, off the post. Almost a chance right there. Almost a goal. Almost. Bro, what, what is your problem? There we go. Let's go. Mark Stahl and Braden Shen throwing it down. Let's go. Here we go. We didn't get a fight with the Sabres, did we? I don't think so. And I'm kicking his ass. Oh, I just whooped his ass with Braden Shen. Sit down, Mark Stahl. Sit down, pal. Sit down. <laughs> he got his ass whooped. He wanted it. He asked for it. And he got... Hey, he, re he shouldn't have asked for it. That's all I can say. Shouldn't have asked for it. Nope. Only a minute 41 left. No, I mean, I just want to sim the end of this game. Start playoffs. That's what I want to do. Eric Gus. I might take the risk here at the end of the second. I'm going to take the risk. Big save by Steve Mason. Big save. Chris Kreider. Oh, there he is. Mark Street. Don't let him score. Whatever we do, just don't let him score. Alright. Well... This is going great. I have to be more aggressive. We're up for nothing. <laughs> I uh, result in the remainder of the game being sent. Yeah, that that's the whole point. We're whooping their ass. Big. Yeah, all right, we still won for nothing. All right, good, 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 good. Good to know. So, make playoffs. We're gonna be playing the Hurricanes. Good, good, good. Here we go. We'll look at the entire playoff tree. That's what we can look at here. So we are making the playoffs. Just like real life. I think, what were they? 7 seed? 8 seed? Look at that. Back in October, when I told you I was expecting 36 wins, I wouldn't have guessed that you would have pulled off 43. You've raised... Thank you. Thank you. We're going to make the playoffs again next year and the year following. That's what we're going to do here. And we got Carolina, and then they're very, very good. 50, and they got Cam Ward in that. They're they're a little bit of a wagon. Oh, it's the wee bit. They, this is a little pretty good. Um, let's look at uh, playoff tree. I want to see who's all playing where and who's playing what. All right, Edmonton. Okay, so it is the way they do it in real life now. So it is just the divisional way. Okay, so the Coyotes. 
the Coyotes made the playoffs. They're playing the Kings. You got to remember in this time frame, the Coyotes were good. The Blackhawks made it. Uh, the Blues made it. The Preds. Oilers avalanche. And they traded Paul Statsney too. So, okay. The Sabres, they made the playoffs. So, the Canadians didn't well, obviously know. The Buffalo Sabres clinched the spot. You got Tampa Bay and Detroit. Carolina and us. And Devils and Penguins. Yep, there's the sex spot again. There it is. Oh, two messages. Real horny. Real, real horny, huh? Let's see where the... Oh, there's, there's three. There's four. Oh, it's just multiplying. Different messages, though. Different emojis. Let's see if there's a fifth. Let's see. Is there going to be a fifth one? New AI dating for all taste and ages. <laughs> what the hell? Blackhawks, they're the mess. The Jets made it. The old Atlanta Thrashers, they made the playoffs. I think that's their, yeah, it would be their first time they made it since obviously moving from Atlanta. At this point, it would be. Um, Who had the most points on the season? Who had the most? Player stats, NHL. Let's go and look. If I had to guess, Patrick Kane. Or Crosby. That's my pick. Crosby or Kane? Tavares. 90 points. 30 goals, 60 assists. John Tavares. Interesting. Sidney Crosby, 95 overall. 79 points. Point per game. Uh, not really that high of point totals here. Bergeron, 78. Martin St. Louis, 76. Claude Giroux. Right up there with the best of them. 75 points in 80 games. Logan Couture. Nicholas Backstrom. Where's Ovi? Did he get the most goals? What? Michael Grabner? Most goals? Then Patrick. Where's Ovi? Did Ovi get hurt? Must have. He must have gotten hurt. There's no way he did not. If he played an 82 game season. And didn't put up 20 goals. Huh? 25 goals in 82 games? Alexander Ovechkin? This is the Alexander Ovechkin we know. Who's going to break the record. Only 25 goals. That's absurd. That's absurd. That That's crazy. That is crazy. There ain't no way in hell. No way. What? Awards. Stanley Cup. The Blackhawks. Kings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. President's Trophy. Oh, okay, so we're not there yet. OV Heart Memorial. Alright. Hmm. Okay, so what are we looking at here? We got the Hurricanes. Should I save this for another time or do it now? Let's let's play game one now. Let's play game one now. Play game one. Play game one. Play game one. Now are we gonna finish the series? Uh, maybe. We'll probably play game one. Ew. They're a oh, home jerseys are ass. Ew. I mean, they're all. I mean, this one's so much better. That that jersey's so much better. But uh, we're just gonna rock with that shitty jersey. Eh, they're ugly. They are ugly. Katuria should be back by like game three, I think. Something there around, around something around there. Young Jeff Skinner. Oh, Jeff Skinner. Before he got paid nine million dollars. <laughs> Before he got paid nine million by Buffalo. Didn't age well at the start, but now it's doing pretty well. I'd say it's doing okay right now. Still a bad contract, but it's doing okay. I'd say so. How's the quality look on stream, boys? You looking good? It looks it to me, but yet again, not really watching. I'm just looking at my TV playing. Ding, 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 ding. Bernie Perrant. It's definitely Bernie. Definitely Bernie. It's, I'm going to see if they do anything special for playoffs. They do anything special like playoff intro or whatever for this game? They don't in NHL 20. I don't think they do in this either. Is the atmosphere a lot better? Curious. It looks the same for playoff intros. Looks the same.
I really wish it was just one through eight. I really wish it was one through eight. But if we win and Pittsburgh wins, we get a battle PA second round. That's what I want. Steve Mason, look at that. Stanley Cup in the background. Are we going to win that this year? Probably not, but can we go for a run? I hope so. I think we can beat Carolina, but Cam Ward is a dog. Cam Ward is a dog, so got to remember that. I think we can maybe still game one, and we'll probably play game four or three. Probably three. Probably play game three. And we'll probably play, eh, yeah, game three. We'll play game three. I want to play the first game in Philly. I want to have a nice consistency run of playoffs. That's what I want to do. All right, come on. Drop it back. To, oh, I was going to drop back to Drew if he stayed right there as a trailer. Oh, oh, four check, four check. Oh, oh, no, okay. Oh, Mazzaro's, get him off. All right, come on, Braden Coburn. Get the puck. Oh, boy, that was a bad pass. Bad. Oh, here we go. Here we go. All right, get to Drew. Drew with the deke. Drew. Are we going to get there on the defense? Yes, we are. Drew. Oh, let's give it over. We got Coburn. Oh, right off the shin. I know that didn't. I know that didn't tickle. Four check. Oh, oh okay. Get, get him off. Oh, Jeff Skinner with the puck. No, no, don't let him in. Don't let him in there. Oh, good stuff. Good stuff. I on Hartsy. Oh, Cogliano almost had it right there. Lee Stepniak, and he is dead. Look. Oh shit, didn't mean to do that. Did not mean to do that. Just want to take a nice little quick <laughs> look at this hit. Look at this. Just, just look at this. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking shit on. He, he's dead. <laughs> look at him. Look at him. Look at this. <laughs> Poor buddy. Oh, he got right up though. He's a warrior. Give him that. He's a warrior. He's a trooper. On Hartnell. Luke Shen. Oh. Get him off the puck. Picking in. The La Rose. I wonder if the Stanley Cup celebration is any different. I don't remember. I'm very curious if it's any different than like. The NHL. Oh my, Matt Reed. He got shit on. Oh, that was a steamer. That was a steamer. I wonder if it's any different compared to like 21 or 20. Yeah, well, even 22 because it was the same for many years. Talbot. Oh, big save there by Cam Ward. Okay, here comes Matt Reed. That's a goal. That's a goal. I can already. Cam Ward said, nah, -uh, not in his house. Okay. Well, shit. Hit him. Here we go, Gustafson. Here we go. Bring it up. One Eric Gustafson with the puck. Bring it on up. He's like a 76 overall. Dancing all over their defense. That's a young Eric Gustafson too. Where is he at now? Chicago? I think so. I think that's where he is. Mazzaro. Giroux. Oh. How many of these guys are even still on the team besides Contarier? That's actually a really good question. I should actually go and look. Drew's not. Shen's not. Voracek's not. Oh. I'm going to look right now. How many of these guys are not even on the team? Besides Couturier. And he's not even playing. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Alright, all the forwards, not on the team. Defense, none of them are on the... Literally no one on this team's... Besides Contarier is on this team anymore. What is that? 12, 18. 18 of the guys on the ice right here. Not even on the squad anymore. And what? Voracek's still playing. Luke Shen's still playing. Drew's still playing. Shen's still playing. The other Shen's still playing. That's five. Mason's not playing no more. Oh, time up. Simmons. We got Wayne still in the league. Hartnell's not. Cogliano. Cogliano's still playing. That's another one. Well, to be fair, I traded for him. He doesn't count. He doesn't count. Damn, this is crazy how much this changed. That's why they're a lot worse, to be fair. Well, they had Drew literally a year ago, to be fair. They had Drew a year ago, and then they traded him because they stunk. 
Well, nothing's happened literally in this first period. Nothing at all. No, no, no. Jeff Skinner with the puck. Oh, Cole Ward. Not really. Oh, boy. That was a bad pass. Eric Stahl. Don't. Don't. Get. 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 Alright, come on, Talbot. Come on, Talbot. Colborn, throw it on. Oh, that's going to end the period. That's going to, yep. And in the period, tied 0-0. Zero, zero. We got a little bit of a defensive hockey game here so far. We're, we're out playing them. They have literally zero shots on net, so they haven't had a whiff of offense. They don't only have, what, time on attack. Not even a minute. 59 seconds. Almost a minute, but not a minute. They're, they're struggling. We're, we're dominating this game. We are dominating. Was built different like that. No shots on net for the Hurricanes. <laughs> Shitter. Shitter. Mazaros. Ooh, that was another nice ass slap shot right there from the point. That was nice as hell. Could have been a goal, but it wasn't. Jeff Skinner with the puck. And he's laid out. Ooh, there's their first shot on net. And the net's off. <laughs> and the net's off. <laughs> All right, come on, face off. We lose it. Oh, come on, Simmons. Oh, big save there by Mason. Greetings from Europe. Oh, welcome. Where are in Europe, if you don't mind me asking? Hartnell, shot. Ooh. Scott Hartnell, snipe. <laughs> Who knew Scott Hartnell had that ability in him just to snipe one bar down? Give us a one nothing lead, huh? How about it? Look at that. Not even from the circle, still from the point. Look at that. Look at that shit. One nothing lead here. Big dump. Big lead. This is huge. Get the first goal in game one. Even though it came in second period. Don't matter. Finland. Well, welcome. Was it nine nine o'clock over there? Well, it might be different time. It's like you guys go by like twenty. What would it be? Twenty one. Would it be twenty one thirty six? Or do you guys go like nine thirty six like we do over here? All right, come on, Reed. Oh, Reed, Reed, Reed. This might be a goal. And it is a goal. We're whooping that ass. 2 nothing lead. Yeah, I think we're probably winning this game unless something drastically changes. We're dominating. Now we're getting the quality shots on net and sniping. Yeah, yeah, they're, they don't stand a chance. I was correct, 23-37. All right. It's not 21, but I was close. I was close. Gotta give me credit. I, I was right. Yeah, it's, it's weird how we do our time compared to the rest of the world. It is pretty weird. I've always found that interesting. Like, our measurement system is completely different than, like, Europe. We go by Fahrenheit. Everyone else goes by, like, Celsius. Just very interesting. Now, come on, forward check. Oh, 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 oh. oh, that could have been a chance. Oh, no. Oh, Shen, that's a goal. That's a goal. That's a goal. Well, I think we're going to win game one. I think we're winning game one. <laughs> this is, uh, I might need to put sliders on because I, I feel like I'm having a little bit too easy of a time, you know, scoring. We're going to play out the rest of this period, and I'm probably going to sim sim the rest of it after the second period. Definitely probably going to sim. All right, come on, Hartnell. Let's go. Hartnell. Ooh, that Cogliano got in the way. Fuck him. Boy Chuck with the puck. Jordan Stahl with it. Get him off. Get him off. Stepniak, well, he's gonna, oh, he's running away. He remembered last time when he saw a defenseman charging at him. He saw what, oh, oh, Mason, get back. Make, get, oh, good, that a boy, that a boy. All right, pass it up. There we go, Colburn. Come on now. Come on. Colburn with the puck. Come on, let's do something. Oh, oh, dance, dancing, dancing. And then that's off. 
That's off the. Oh, damn! We I was dancing around that defender. He stood no chance. Come on, team! Ooh, don't, Luke! You didn't need to do that. <laughs> Luke, you didn't need to do that, pal. What the hell? I win this draw. I have baby Shen. Give it to Luke Shen. The Shen, the Shen brother. That's crazy. They used to be on the same team. Now, obviously, they're not anymore. How long did that last? How long was Luke Shen in Philly for? It's a good question. What, 2016 maybe he was out of here? 2016, 17? I know Braden left 2017. Oh, Jeff Skinner just killed him. Slap shot. Oh, that's a goal. Yep, I saw that one coming. Jeff Skinner. There it is. Two goal game. This game's far from over. They just put themselves back in it. All right. They just put themselves back in this game. We just got to stay focused. We're going to have what? After this, 20 minutes remaining in the third. Just hang on. Just don't choke it. That's all I can do. Just don't choke. Ooh, nice block there by Nick Grossman. It's five seconds remaining. Let's give it up to Reed. Oh, Reed's going to get this. Oh. Colburn. Ah, oh, it was a dumb pass. I should just threw it on. That was so stupid. All right. At the end of two, three, one. We're out playing them. I. Well, how many shots they got? Like five, six. They have six shots. Yeah, we're we're shutting it down. Well, that's all six shots in one period. They didn't have any in the first, so we're doing good job defensively. Very good job defensively. Okay. Mazzaro's up to Giroux. Giroux. Oh, okay. Sakara. Oh, we might have Giroux out in front. Oh, that was pretty good backhander, but it was a little funky. Just a little bit. Just a wee bit funky. Just a wee bit. All right. Damn, we're out hitting them two by ten. 15 to five. They have no physicality, no nothing. Whoo! Wayne Train almost just buried that one. Almost. He almost buried her. Oh, should have grabbed the puck, Wayne. Come on. Oh. I got Cogliano coming with you. Cogliano. Cogliano. And he loses it. That's uh, just fantastic. Just lay him out. Oh, no. Oh, no. Big save by Steve Mason. Look at that. Good stuff. Oh, come on, Cogliano. Here we go. Use your speed. Damn it. His speed's not really being shown off as much as I thought it would be. Like, the defense are still hanging with him. I mean, that's not a bad thing, but, like, he should probably be burning him. Probably. Definitely should be. Come on, Shen. Keep putting that pressure on him. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Great two-way game by Braden Shen right there. Look at that. Oh, and Voracek just got murdered by Eric Stahl. That was not ideal. <laughs> right back at you. Fuck you. All right, come on, Drew. Slap shot. Bury it home. Ooh. Gleason with the puck. Oh, my God. There's bodies flying all over. They're all over the place. Come on, Coburn. Reed. Rip it home. Or a shot blocked. Okay. Oh, look at Steve Mason toe save right there. What, we got six and a half minutes remaining, and we have a delayed penalty. Let's go. We're going to get a power play here. Colburn, look at him. Look at him. We got Matt Reed right here. I'm, oh, good defense, but that could have been a goal. That easily could have been a goal. All right, we're going to time up. We're going to at least try to. I don't know who that was defensively, but he almost, um, um, Mason, Mason, get in there. Okay, well, we're good now. See, Mason worried me for a moment. All right, it would be nice if we got him off the puck. That would that'd be quite nice. Is that Justin Falk? I think so. And we can't grab the puck. Okay. That's, that's, come on. It's, we, we were getting dominated on our own power play. It's like they, it was theirs. We're getting dominated. Get the puck off him, please. Oh, my. We, I don't even know if we really even had possession at all. All right, here we go, finally. And we're just going to lose the puck, aren't we? Oh, oh, and we drew a penalty. 
That this might be one of the worst power plays you've ever seen in maybe ever. And look, we can't grab it. It's like they're on the power play. That's a goal. It's like I can't grab the puck. I literally couldn't grab it. Now it's a one goal game. We still have our power play. Their power play got killed off. Shorthanded goal. We have four minutes to hang on. This is actually crucial. All right. This is actually this is a little nerve wracking a little bit. Gotta hang on. Come on, boys. Let's go. Give it up. All right. Let's go, Scott Hartnell. Let's go, Hartnell. Ooh, Hartnell. Oh, he had the chance. He had the lane. Good cut off right there by who was that? Sakara. Well, he got laid out for it. You're welcome. Oh, Semin. Nice block there by Tiemann. and Put your body on the line. This is playoffs. You got to do that stuff. All right, get the Talbot. Here we go. Maxine Talbot. Drop it back. Get to Mazzaro's. Oh, Justin Falk. It's a hand pass. <clears throat> no, it's not, but I just want to say that. All right, come on, Drew. Drew with the dangle. Drew around the defender. Got a heart. Oh, throw it on. Oh, he... If he didn't get knocked right there, I think that would have been a nice little opportunity. Because Hartnell was right there, wide open. Right with him. Alright, they're going to pull the goaltender here. We need to play some shutdown defense. No. How did they not pull the goal yet? There they go. Now they are. Now we got the puck. We got possession. They got Braden Shen. That's game, baby. If we hit this, that is game. We're going to take game one. That is huge. They pulled the goalie way too late. They pulled him way too late. They should have done it when they immediately turned... Went around, turned over the puck, and went into our zone. They waited till like 30 seconds. That makes no sense. You're supposed to do that with like a minute. They waited so long for that. That that hurt them big time. Well, we're going to take that. We'll gladly take that. We'll take game one. We will gladly take that as the eighth seed. Well, even though they're not listed eighth seed, second wild card, we'll take that. Come on, Drew. Drew. Oh, oh my. Oh, my. He, he got destroyed. And he got destroyed again. And no, I can't have this. I can't have this. Come on, bitch. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Fight. Uh, Drew penalty. Nah, I'm not having Drew getting bitched by some no-name bum, okay? Not happening. That's my captain, okay? You lay your fucking grimy hands off him. Get off him. Two. One. Game. Big dub. Big game one dub right there. Huge. Huge W. Huge W. Hey, we could pull this offset off. Let's say, like I said, this is 2010-esque. A little bit of a better goaltender, I'd say, with Steve Mason. A little bit better. He had a really good year, though. He had a really good year for us. Look at that snipe. Look at that. I mean, what a game for us. Great all-around. Good offensive game. Good defense. Good stuff, boys. Good stuff. Love to see it. All right, we're just going to sim game two here. Sim up to this date. We're going to simcast, and then I'm probably going to end the stream. Maybe pick this up tomorrow, maybe later tonight, depending. Depending. We're going to simcast, and let's see where this puts us for tomorrow night or whenever. Oh, man, the simcast looks so different in this. Okay, how do I... Oh, they even have goal horns. Okay, this is so different. Okay, let's slow it down a bit. Oh, it's 2 nothing. Okay, um, there's so much going on. There's so much going on. It's 2-2. How do I fix it to where it's just goals? I know there's a way. Uh, this is this is confusing me. This is, <laughs> this is confusing me. All right. It, I know there's a way. Right, how fast am I even going? Oh, okay. I see. I see over here. Let's slow it down. Let's go to four. Here we go. Power play for us. Come on. Can we do something? No, we can't. Okay, man. Shit, look how fast this shit's going. It goes quicker than the current game. I just wish I could fix it where it's just goals that are being shown. Because I have no idea who scored. All right. Well, it's third period. Oh, my God. This is going so much faster. Power play for the Hurricanes. Come on. Let's kill it off. All right. We're still down one. <sighs> okay. Well, come on. Can somebody score? Tie up the game. Force games. Game. Well, not force. But, like, be a 1-1. One, one. Two. Oh, yeah. I don't think we're scoring here. They're out shooting us. They're out playing. Zach Ronaldo. What a stud. It is a 3 3. Oh, shit. This, is, this stuff's going fast. All right. Ooh, this shit's going a little fast. All right. We have overtime. Okay. Come on. Come on. Please. S someone please score for the Flyers. I have to be specific. What's up, Kobe? I have to be specific. We're getting up there with the shots with them. Power play for the Hurricanes. We kill it off. Let's go, boys. Come on now. 
Uh, oh, we win game two. That's huge. This game, game three back in Philadelphia is a 2-0 series lead going into game three. It's 2-0. We can easily do this. I said we can easily beat these guys. I said we can. We're up 2-0. We put up a comeback rally late. That's how you do it, baby. And Coots is back for game three. Oh. Oh, he's back. Oh, this is great. This is great stuff. Oh, uh, we're going to put Coots here. How's Shen doing, though, in these playoffs, though? How is he doing? Three points? I think you got to leave Shen first line. I think you have to. Yeah, I'd leave him first line. Voracek, Shen, Giroux, Coots. Should I say Simmons? Simmons, maybe... We'll do Simmons and Hartnell. We'll do that. And then uh, I'm going to take out Rose Hill. And then I would say probably put in Colborn. Because he's actually really interested skaters. Come on, game. I mean, Colborn's been really good for us. So. And oh, I'd actually do this. Cagliano in the wing. Boom. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. That's how it should look. There we go. And defensively. We're looking nice. We are looking nice. Yes, sir. There we go. We're going to be looking good. Uh, Coburn, Mazaros, Timonen, Shen, Grossman, and Gustafson. All right. Zabi oh, how do I undress him? Okay, that, that sounded weird. Okay, not like that. <laughs> how do I make sure he's not playing? Is he on like the penalty kill lines? He might be. That might be why. He might be on a penalty kill line. Second fair hobby, uh, Oilers, just because of McDavid. Whatever team McDavid's on. Simple as that. It's just whatever team McDavid's on. I keep it plain and simple. Don't really have a second team, but if I had to pick one, it's the Oilers, simply because of McDavid. McDavid leaves, I leave. Simple as that. They want... We're just going to have to deal with it. They're just being weird. They're just being weird. We just can fix up the lines one last time. And we'll call it a stream. Good stream, though. Good stream. That's a, that's a lot of viewers, actually, at certain points. It was good. It was good. It was good. Uh, Shen, Giroux, Voracek, Simmons, Coots, Hartnell, Cogliano. Ah, nah. We have, to, we have to stick with that. We have to stick with that because they want Colburn not in the game. Whatever. It is what it is. So, that will be the stream. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, maybe we do another one. We stream again late tonight or tomorrow night. It's going to be around that, or sometime tomorrow. It's going to be sometime around then. It might be tomorrow afternoon. I think that's a possibility. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Uh, check out for the next stream coming. And probably do an NHL 14 series coming soon. Team, 